Hey guys, it's Infinite, and today we're playing some Kill Confirmed on Bootleg using the Scar L with Silencer. My perks are Scavenger Pro, Assassin Pro, and Dead Silence Pro. This is just a quick gameplay. I think I go 26 and 1. I figured it was the perfect length for me to do the commentary I want to do. Um, I speed up like two minutes of Reaper into AC into um, Osprey Gunner at the end. And if this map was good for air support, this could have been a huge game. <clears throat> so, whatever, you win some and you lose some. But what I wanted to talk about today is the best SMGs in this game. Now, I don't think there's one. I think there's a few that, you know, it's they're definitely subjective because not everyone likes the same gun and the same feel in their guns. But a lot of big commentators, not a lot, but definitely a few, and even some mid-sized commentators... And when I say big and mid-sized, I'm saying like 50,000 to 100,000 plus. So, I'm talking pretty big channels. Are saying that they like the P90 the most. And I wanted to tackle this issue, you know, a few days ago, maybe maybe even a week ago. But I wanted to have a lot of usage with all the, the three SMGs that I'm going to talk about today. And those SMGs are the PP90, the P90... And the MP7. I think we could all agree that those three are the best in the game, and there's n the other ones don't even contend. So, before getting into this, I'm going to give you guys some gun stats. The PP90 holds 36 rounds, 72 with extended mags, and shoots 1,000 rounds per minute. Now, that's, that's extremely fast, right? You, you would never want to use rapid fire with that. That's really fast. The P90 holds 50 rounds. And shoots 857 rounds per minute. Now that's pretty fast, but believe it or not, guys, it's kind of towards the bottom of the SMG class. A lot of them shoot faster than that, believe it or not. The only ones that shoot slower are the MP5 and the UMP. So, about average in that area, but has the 50 round capacity, which is obviously the best in its class. With extended mags, got 100, which is insane. Finally, the gun that a lot of people are overlooking because you unlock it late and you just prestige is the MP7. I like this. I like to call this gun the hybrid of the two. It's got 40 rounds, so it's got a little bit more, kind of in between, you know. It's got a little bit more than the PP90 and a little bit less than the P90. Obviously, the PP90 is close with 36 compared to 40, but still a little bit more. And you know, you notice that stuff. And it shoots 895 rounds per minute, so it's a little bit faster than the PP90, but still a little bit behind the PP90. So, now I'll start out with the P90. The P90 compares very well with the MP7. The PP90 is kind of its own entity, so I'm not going to talk about that till the end. The PP90, or, I'm sorry guys, the P90 versus the MP7. So the P90 holding 50 rounds is 10 more than the MP7's 40, which, you know, definitely means something, adds a lot of value to the gun. 10 bullets is a, you know, it's, it's definitely noticeable when bullets are coming out so fast. So that definitely gives it up in that area. But honestly, guys, outside of that, I don't think the P90 beats the MP7 any other way. I think the MP7 has better iron sight. It doesn't have like that like little like half circle type deal that the P90 does. It just has just standard little dot there. I just like the way the iron sights are. And it shoots faster. And when you use this class, it's the most popular class, you know, rapid fire silencer or rapid fire extended mags. The MP7 outclasses the P90. It obviously it's going to shoot a little bit faster because naturally it shoots what like 50 rounds per minute faster. So you're going to add even more to that because of the rapid fire, and the gun is so much easier to control. Like the P90 kind of recoils everywhere. The MP7 just recoils up and kind of levels out, and it's really controllable. So the MP7 definitely has the edge over the P90. And then the PP90, I'm out of time, guys, I'm going to try to rush this up. The PP90 is kind of its own thing. I think it has the least recoil of all of them. Your best bet is to run kick and silencer or two attachments and sil silencer with extended mags. If you do that, you're going to lose a little bit of control over the gun, but it's its own entity, and I think it's just as good as the MP7. All right, I'll talk to you next.